Hi. Today I'm going to answer a question about how NLP can help you to reach your hopes and dreams. Hi, I'm Dr. Heidi Heron. Thank you so much for joining me. I received a question not long ago about how can NLP help me to achieve my hopes and dreams. So as I'm sitting here in Honolulu, Hawaii, just about to head out to Denver, Colorado to visit my family and friends, I thought I would share some of this insight with you. So our hopes and dreams, or from an NLP perspective, I would call your desires. Your desires are what you want. And if your intention is to have something, having and holding your attention on that is important, but so is simply getting your mind set right. What we think affects what we feel and what we do. What we do affects what we feel and what we think, and what we feel affects what we think and what we do. All three of those. So everything is interact interlaced. What we see, what we feel, what we do, and what we think. When we can get an alignment between our behaviors, our actions, which might be our behaviors, our behaviors, our attitude, and our thoughts, we got some good stuff going. So I, I suppose a better word than even attitude would be emotion. So our behaviors, our emotions, and our thoughts, then we can be aligned with where we're going. NLP has a lot to do with our hopes and dreams because it's our patterns, the patterns of emotions, behaviors, and thoughts that either propel us forward towards what we want or hold us back from what we don't want. And sometimes people are motivated towards what they want and sometimes people are motivated away from failure, away from getting hurt, away from being stuck. And being able to understand your motivations can really help you to move in the direction that you're going into. Even having a clear plan that is aligned and in, and in congruence, so alignment, with what you want is important. Making sure that your beliefs are in line, making sure that you have the resources that you need to achieve your desired states. And being able to apply some of the NLP tools that we have. We've got different things like goals in the future or clearing unpa uh, unconscious pattern change for limiting beliefs or limiting patterns that might be holding us back from having what we want. We are limited only by our mind. If there is something that you truly want to do, if it's come to Hawaii, learn NLP, start your own business, quit your job, you have what you need to achieve that. Sometimes we just need to get our ducks in a row. We may need to clear some of the beliefs that might be holding us back and really uncover those resources that we've got that will help to spur us on to what it is that we desire. Knowing what your hopes and dreams are is such a key aspect to getting there. But even if at the moment, if you're sitting here listening going, yeah, but I don't have, I don't have the time, I don't have the money, I don't have the willpower, work on those things. Clear any patterns that are holding you back. If truly money is an issue, start to utilize the law of attraction, clear the patterns and create the awareness around bringing into your, your awareness and into your life the resources that you need. I can guarantee you that there's not one thing in life that if you truly want and desire that you can't have. You can have those things. And sometimes it takes sacrifice of something in order to achieve it. Um, for example, I have a friend that wanted to own a home and she actually realized that her spending was getting in the way. So we actually utilized a few NLP techniques to curb her spending. And so she had to sacrifice on some new shoes and a new hat every now and then. She loves hats but she was able to get the home that she wants and she was able to align her behaviors and her intentions and her emotions to get what she wants. So what does NLP have to do with hopes and dreams? It can have everything to do with hopes and dreams. Please share with me your questions, like my Facebook channel, and I will share with you another day. Thanks very much.